It was summer. You and your friends were visiting Indiana for about a week. On the last day of your vacation, you and your friends decided to go to the local pool in Hawkins. You were wearing one of your favorite bathing suits. It complimented every single inch of your body. You looked great and felt great. As you walked to the pool area, a really hot male lifeguard was leaving the pool. His shift must have just ended, but you noticed he started walking a bit slower once he looked your way. You couldn't tell if he was looking at you or someone else near you because of his sunglasses, but you were definitely staring at him. One of, his, one of your friends would tap you on the shoulder and tell you to stop staring. You just laughed and kept walking. Later, you'd see the same lifeguard sitting by the pool. Why is he still here? He is clearly not working. You got out of the pool to get a drink of water. Your friends were in distance. And then you'd hear someone walk up behind you. Hey. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> you okay? Sorry, uh, you... <sighs> I, uh, saw you staring at me, and I will admit, I checked you out a couple times, as well. I'm Billy, and you, uh, okay, you aren't from Hawkins, are you? No, I, I didn't think so. No, I, I've never seen you here before. Trust me, I'd know if you've been here before. Because you're ridiculously hot. Hey, don't look at, look away. I'm serious. You're really hot. And that bathing suit, I mean, come on. How could I not come up to you? So, uh, you're here with those friends? Yeah. <laughs> I know it's nothing. Are you busy later by chance? No, you seem cool. I just was wondering if maybe you wanted to hang out. You know, we could go to my place or just just hang out. Or where are you staying? A motel. Hmm. You got your own room? Okay, so why don't we hang out there? Yeah. Here, uh, use this pen. Write your, write the address and motel number on my arm. Yeah. Okay, perfect. I'll meet you there. Let's say nine o'clock. Perfect. I'll see you then, hottie. Billy would then wink and give you a bit of a smirk before walking to the change room. You'd grab a quick sip of your water and hop back into the pool with your friends. A couple hours go by and it was 8.30. You would put on one of your most revealing but yet casual outfits. You would put on some of your nicest accessories and you'd be looking fine as hell. He'd spend the next half an hour stressing if you looked good enough for him. He'd question why the hell he would have talked to you in the first place, out of everyone there. Why were you so special? 9.03, the clock would roll around, and you'd be waiting for him to knock on the door, impatiently. Till... You would run over and open the door as he'd lean against the door frame. Hey, you look amazing. Holy shit. I love the outfit. No, really, it looks sexy as fuck on you. Mind if I come in? Thanks. So, uh, how are you? That's good. Yeah, this isn't a terrible motel. I thought it would be a lot shittier. Yeah. 
So, uh, what do you want to do? Hey, Hadi, look at me. Are you okay? Well, I asked you a question and you zoned out a bit. You look stressed. You are? That's okay. I, I can help with that. Mind if I sit next to you? Oh, okay. Good, come here. No, oh, come here. I don't bite. You would scooch next to him till your guys' thighs were pressing against each other's. He would move his hand slowly up onto your cheek, and he would slowly move his face closer to yours. Your heart was racing with excitement, and you two would begin making out, basically. <laughs> As you two were making out, everything you had been stressing about left your mind. As you were kissing, he would slowly slide his hand from your cheek down to your thigh, and grab on to your hip, kind of sliding you down and laying you down on the bed as he would take his shirt off. You two would slowly remove clothing until you were just in your undergarments, and he would finally remove his lips from yours, giving both of you the chance to breathe. Are you sure you want to do this? Okay, okay. I was just asking. I was trying to be nice. Jeez. Okay. You ready? Okay. Okay, I'm not going to go into much more detail, but you know what happened. It was the next morning, the day you were leaving to go home, you would be in his shirt and your underwear, nothing else, and he would be just in his boxers, and he is passed out with his head laying on your chest and his one arm, like, wrapped around your hip, um, and you would wake up and begin playing with his hair as he would also slowly wake up. Okay, Hadi. How did you uh, uh, sleep? That's good. So, what are you doing today? <coughs> huh? You're going home. Wait, seriously? This is a joke, right? You're seriously going home. When will I get to see you again? Next summer. Well, what the fuck? Okay. Okay. No, it's fine. We're cuddling for a bit more then. And you're giving me your number and I'm calling you. Because, fuck, I'm not losing you. Yeah? Sound good? Okay, good. Okay, guys, so this is the end of the video, I know. <laughs> um, I hope it was okay. It was my first, like, somewhat spicy content, I guess. And, you know, what better character to do spicy content for than Billy Hargrove, am I right? Anyway, I just wanted to quickly say I am new to this whole voice acting YouTube account thing. And I thought I was doing, like, good, and I was happy with everything that I was doing in the beginning. But I'm not deleting videos. I'm not quitting. I'm not, no, I'm not doing any of that. Trust me. Um, I just want to change a couple things, and I just want to address it so you guys aren't like, why are her videos changing all of a sudden? Um, but I'm not going to be talking in the be beginning of a lot of videos unless it's, like, a warning Um, for like trigger warning or anything like that. That's the only thing I can think of that'll be in the beginning of a video. But yeah, so I won't be deleting anything, but I'm going to be, I changed my covers. Like for this one, I'm trying something new. So I hope you guys like it. If you guys like this or think I could change it, let me know in the comments. Um, 
but yeah I don't know I don't know I just didn't like the other ones they seemed awkward and like yeah <laughs> yeah love you all and thank you for 100 subscribers I love you all I think 100 in like what a week is ridiculous to me like that's really vast and I love you all it's crazy <laughs> anyways I love you bye